so, so what's the series this weekend? Tell me how uh, well your girls stepped up the, in uh, – the yeah, I thought we saw some really good offense from our team. We had a lot of really good quality at bats. Uh, I think the thing that I'm most proud of with our team this weekend is just their ability to fight back. They weren't all perfect games. Um, we had some mistakes in there, um, but their willingness to just keep fighting and grinding until they could uh, come away with a W in each of the games was pretty critical and exciting to see. All right. uh, and you're headed to Tulsa this uh, week? Yep. Uh, last time you met was in 2015. You know, only time we've ever played together. Okay. Uh, how well do you know them, even though it's been once and it was seven years ago? I don't know them real well. Uh, I watched their game against Tech this weekend, but I think it's just a good matchup for us. This was a, a good midweek doubleheader for us to go on um, a road trip during uh, spring break because of proximity and just seeing a new opponent. Really, that was the rationale with uh, scheduling them. So we're excited. I think it's going to be, we're looking at uh, statistics and watching video, and I think it's going to be a good matchup for us. Coach, I want to talk about a couple of players specifically. Uh, Sydney Holman, so 239 ERA. She seems like she's mm -hmm. as consistent as they come for you guys. Riley White also yeah. uh, in the circle. And then uh, at the plate, uh, Callie Burr is in 371 yeah. in 24 games. Tell me about those individuals. Yeah, Callie has done phenomenal. Um, she's really just uh, fighting every at bat for us. I think her senior leadership is critical for us, and um, she's produced a ton of RBIs lately. Um, and just uh, putting a lot of pressure on defense. I think they they tried to play a shift on her, and she was able to burn them in a lot of different directions this weekend. And um, she just is really in a groove uh, on pitching. I'm very happy with Sydney's leadership. Uh, Honestly, these weren't the best uh, outings for her, uh, you know, if you're calling pitches and you know what's going on, and you couldn't tell because she just keeps fighting for us and giving us an opportunity to make some plays, and her leadership is phenomenal in the circle, and I think that's allowed Riley to really step up um, and run alongside her this year, so it's fun to watch those two. Uh, Loren actually had a really good relief outing for the six final outs to get us the win in the second game that... Um, shouldn't be overlooked. Her relief and uh, ability to close games is going to be big for us this year. You guys have maybe the toughest opponent in the league in SFA to start conference mm -hmm. play, and then you get a couple of close games against UIW with a quick turnaround. How nice was it to see your team finish off a sweep in a conference game on the road this week? Oh, it was huge. It was a really big breath of fresh air to watch them bounce back from um, – Two really disappointing losses against UIW, honestly. Uh, the, the captains led a practice before we left, and I think that was really good for them to just figure out what they want to do, what did they want to, what did they want to fix, and then turn around and reload uh, to go into Lamar. They reset their minds and um, came out and just competed and had a ton of fun. They were really clicking together this weekend, and I'm glad that they got to see some Ws out of that.